Hello all the tech geeks, this is Sobnin from Techlands. And guess what? This is the Xiaomi Redmi 1S. So according to the internet, it is the best budget smartphone in the world. But let's unbox it and see, is it worth the hype? So here is the box, standard Xiaomi box and as you all know Xiaomi boxes are made for e-commerce especially so these can withstand a lot of force. So first of all we get the SIM card trace. So while I'm doing this, let's do a rundown of the specs. So this phone is running on the Snapdragon 400 SoC, uh, which is clocked at 1.6 GHz at quad cores. It has a 1 GB RAM, and uh, it it is uh, it is sporting a 4.7 inch 720p display, which is mighty impressive for this price bracket, which is 6,000 rupees. And here are the two SIM card trays. Let's keep this aside. And it also has the Adreno 305 graphics. So next we have the scratch card. And here is the Xiaomi Redmi 1S box. So it looks pretty good. Let's unbox it. And also let me confirm that this phone is running on the MIUI uh, but it's not the Android version 4.4 it's running on Android version 4.3 but Xiaomi has promised an upgrade to Android 4.4 so you can be rest assured but it will take some time to port Android 4.4 to MIUI and pretty good cardboard box very good quality box so first of all we have the Xiaomi Redmi 1S So here is the phone So first of all we have some sensors here Here is the front facing camera And I believe it says 1.6 megapixel camera And here is the earpiece 4.7 inch 720p display The 3 touch capacity buttons And we also have a uh, notification LED here the 8 megapixel autofocus camera with one single LED flash, the secondary microphone, the speaker, me branding here. Down we have the primary microphone and the micro USB charging port. At the top we have the 3.5mm headphone jack. Let's keep it aside and see what's there in the box. So here we get a sort of envelope. And inside it, here is the user manual and here is the warranty statement. So everything is in this cardboard wooden sort of style. Then we have the charger, pretty well built charger, really good, impressed, really impressed with this charger. Then we have the micro USB cable. Here is the micro USB cable, and I hope it is pretty good length cable. And here is the battery, me branded, branded battery. And let me see the capacity. So it's a 2050 mAh battery. Model number is BM41. We have nothing else in the box, so let's keep all this aside and see what the phone looks like. So here's the phone and the battery. Let me keep it aside and tear off this screen cover. Quite piece. Not much noise. 
we also have a protector on the camera okay so let me see where is the tab and here is the tab to pull out the back cover I forgot to mention that here is the, here is the power button and here is the volume rockers the both are metallic buttons it seems when we take out the back cover we can see the micro USB port here I am really sorry the memory card uh, slot here and here are the two full size sim card slots so let me also put in a memory card so here is the memory card I need to ins take it up and then open it and place your micro SD card I have a 32GB micro SD card here but uh, as the flip card page says it can support up to 64 GB micro SD cards and let me put in the battery and let's just power on the phone So it really has a very good build quality, very robust build quality and the back cover doesn't move, it doesn't squeak. Normal me startup. So here, is it. here it is, welcome me UI. Here we have some keyboards. I will select Google keyboard, not shift key. Wi Fi. So we'll put in the Wi Fi password and come back. So, okay, I'm back. Connected. Next. Checking for SIM card. There is no SIM card. So, continue. Next. Agree. Start using me UI. So as soon as you start up your phone, you will seem like you are using a Mi 3. But no, it's a Redmi 1S. And it doesn't have an app drawer. And Mi UI is made to look like iOS. So here's the dialer. and let me show you the keyboard it's the normal google keyboard messaging oh, sorry browser messaging and here is the notification bar and as soon as you start your phone you will see that there is an update available which is to 36 and it's an 22 megabyte update and let's update it so it is just a normal bug fix update it is not anything special let it download in the background and you know that MIUI has some of these cool features like these you also have this with the notes app Here it is. And let's see the lock screen. So here is the lock screen. And when you double tap on the lock screen, there are your media controls. You can swipe down to unlock. These are some cool nifty features. So now I will set up the phone completely. And you can also see that there is a built in theme engine here. that is good and you can also see the toggles so Mi UI is very much customizable and really a good experience when you use Mi UI let me see the camera 
and I would have to say that the screen is very very vivid for this price bracket so here is the box of the Xiaomi Redmi 1S let me click a photo so it auto focuses really fast there is a slight bit of lag in the shutter but it's quite fast is the video and we'll see the normal settings that you can see in the Xiaomi Mi 3 picture quality means the 4 to 3 or 16 to 9 is picture quality I set it to high some cool nifty features we have HDR, Panorama. Let us see what how the photos come out. So the photos come out to be really great. It is a 8 megapixel camera and the photos come out really great. Here's the front facing camera. I'm recording. So this was it. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Please comment your thoughts below and subscribe to this channel. This was Sopnim from Techlands. Have a nice day.